everyone and welcome back to another video. I went to Hungary for a couple of days and in this video I'll be showing you everything I did. we took a boat ride along the river Danube, which is the second longest river in Europe. The Danube flows through or makes part of the border of 10 countries in Europe. The river Danube is in the middle of two sides of Budapest, Buda and Pest. The Buda part is to the left of the river and the Pest part is to the right of the river. Romine Beach is well known amongst inhabitants and tourists as a local recreational area and water sports facility. Between spring and autumn it is used as a popular entertainment area with many open air gastronomy facilities and bars. Situated between the Chain Bridge and Margaret Bridge, the Parliament Building draws your attention from almost every riverside point. It is one of the city's most iconic buildings. I then took a bus tour around Budapest. Elizabeth Bridge is named after popular Hasbro Queen Elizabeth. It is the third newest bridge in Budapest.
synagogue seats 3,000 people and it is a centre of Neolog Judaism. The Millennium Monument in the middle of the square was erected to commemorate the thousand-year-old history of the Magyars. Budapest Castle is a royal historic castle built in the 13th century when Hungary was invaded by the Mongol. Here you'll find many of Budapest's most important historic sites and tourist attractions. The St. Stephen statue is a majestic statue of the first king of Hungary and later patron saint. then went to see the shoes along the river Danube. The shoes on the Danube bank is a memorial created by film director Kan Toge with sculptor Gula Paula on the east bank of the Danube river to honour the Jews who were killed by fascist Arrow Cross militiamen in Budapest during World War II. The monument consists of 60 pairs of 1940 style shoes True to life in size and detail, sculptured out of iron.